Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Noel Haynes II. Today for this poem video, I'm going to bring you the exciting conclusion to the trilogy of Onesha, the Dark Witch. In this video, get ready to learn how her story ends. Let's begin. Onesha 7, The Romance of Rebecca Standing in front of my sister's tombstone, I stood there in silence. I stood there all alone. As I stood at my sister's grave, the grave of Onesha, whose life I could not save, Jacob Baines, a man of wealth, came to comfort me, to ensure my good health. Jacob Baines was a wealthy painter, whose portraits told the story of his family's splendor. What does he see in me? A girl at age 18, a girl just in white, and a girl with blonde hair who hasn't lost her sprite. After he gave me a red rose, Jacob finished my painting and asked for my hand in marriage. With a golden ring on my tiny finger, I said yes to this handsome painter. Onesha 8, A Sister's Wedding Roses are red, violets are blue. Onesha, my dear little sister, have I got some news for you. I, Rebecca, your older sibling, am getting married. Isn't that a wonderful thing? I'm marrying Jacob Baines, a rich man of God, who loves me unconditionally, for it isn't a facade. Wearing a beautiful white dress, I slowly walked down the aisle towards my handsome groom, who gave me a loving smile. As our lips met, we started to walk in the distance into a hopeful sunset. Onesha, my dear little sister, this next part is a whirlwind twister. I saw our mother. I promise this isn't a lie. She gave me a white rose as she walked towards my husband and I. She said, the seeds in your womb are beginning to grow. Be good and faithful, Rebecca, for there is much for you to know. Onesha 9, Twin Showdown Origins. Onesha, from 1692 to 1693, the Salem Witch Trials brought nothing but death and misery. About 20 people were executed over something that was nonetheless convoluted. Onesha, on a cold winter night, I made a wish on a star. While holding a candle light, I wished to see you again as you appeared at midnight. Onesha, still filled with anger and bitterness, you lunged at me as I pierced your heart of darkness with a glowing sword that was given to me by an angel of the Lord to vanquish those who act maliciously. I'm sorry, Onesha. As the sword continued to glow, you looked at me with sad eyes and said, I know, Rebecca, I know. My sister Onesha was sent back to hell while I went into labor Letting out a violent yell, I gave birth to my twin children, who were perfect in every way. My name is Rebecca Baines, and my twin children grew up to have their own families one day. The Baines family soon immigrated to a new land, a land that became San Diego, California, where their next generation would expand. 327 years later, a descendant named Peter Baines was helping his wife Gabriella as she was going through labor pains. And so, as the trilogy of Onesha concludes, remember, the Lord can help us with our chains, just as he will help one of these twins called Daniel and Pierre Baines. Placing your faith in witchcraft 
will only lead to condemnation, but placing your faith in the Lord Jesus will always lead to your salvation. Well, everyone, I hope you enjoyed the conclusion to the Trilogy of Onesha. Please bow your heads with me as we pray. Lord Jesus, I come to you now in your holy name. Lord Jesus, I am a sinner and I need to be saved. I believe that you died for my sins. I ask that you would forgive my sins, Lord Jesus. I ask that you would come into my heart and save my soul. And let not my will be done, but your Father's will. In your name, Lord Jesus, I ask all these things. Amen. Thank you for listening, and God bless you all. Goodbye!